What's up everyone, top 5 dude back on your screen and in this video we'll be taking a look at when men stop simping for women part 44. Girl begs her ex-boyfriend to take her back after she was caught cheating on him. She probably has nothing going for her anymore after she got dumped. I bet she's one of those girls who lived off of her men and didn't do anything herself and now that she got caught cheating she wants him back. It's just not how it works. Back to the streets you go. Golfing. Okay. <coughs> when you, the Tuesday after Super Bowl. Tuesday after Super Bowl was at the, 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 the 14th? I could do the 14th. Yeah, I got nothing going on that day. Honey. I got I work Honey. till three thirty, but I see if I leave early. That's Hold on one second. Hold on a second. Um, I I can see if I can leave work early. Um, That's February fourteenth, honey. Yeah, I know. It's February fourteenth. Um, you don't have any plans leave. on that day. Hold on one second. I'm on the phone. All right. Hold on one second. Um, I I could probably find you know two more guys. Is? Um, you'll play probably at least catch nine after work. Do you guys know what day that is? Hold on one second. Do you know that I'm on the phone? Sorry, she just... It's like the minute I get on the phone, she just starts. It's unbelievable. But yeah, I'm good for that day. I, I, I'll uh, I'll ask two of the guys from work to see if they want to uh, want to go too. I'm, yeah, no, that'll be fun. Hopefully it's nice out. That honestly could have been me. I don't know about you guys, but I personally think days like Valentine's Day are a bit overrated. I honestly don't need a special day to celebrate my love for someone. But yeah, that might just be me. Craziest thing you did to get a girl to like you. I had convinced this chick that I was dying. <laughs> <laughs> I was in like ninth grade. I convinced like four or five people I had cancer. All her friends. This took me two years to accomplish. You fake dying for two years? Was it mission um, accomplished? Of course. Is this That's the girl you with now? <laughs> nah, hell no. <nah>. So <laughs> she think I died. <laughs> <laughs> so I told her I moved in with my friend because my mom couldn't stand to see me like that. <laughs> so every time. <laughs> this thing. Brianna and I have been together for like seven years and I drink and she doesn't drink and um, yeah, she's boring as f This was going on my, my neighbor's really trying to sing to my girlfriend <laughs> Oh, and I might have to come down and handle that you are And she laughing about it And she laugh. so you like what's going on? Alright, is that what you plan on doing tonight? Getting f raped? Is that what you want? Can you Megan, you wanna go down that path? I'm not trying to be mean right now, I'm just trying to talk to you, seriously. Okay. I'm... Megan, that is a lip. That is like a gloss. Megan. Whatever guy you like go near is just gonna attract no, off. stop, stop. I don't wanna hear that, please, Megan. Megan, I really thought you had more respect for yourself. Apparently I don't. You don't, Megan. No, nope. please stop. Stop, Megan. You don't have to be like this. This guy needs to either dump her or set some boundaries. He clearly does not agree to what she's doing and she doesn't seem to care at all. That just doesn't seem like a good relationship to me. The most attractive part on her body? Her face. True. Would you punch Sarah in the face for a thousand dollars? You know what? No. You know what? Man. You have the capabilities to satisfy Sarah in bed. How would I answer that question? With a yes or a no? <laughs> I'm going to say I strongly believe yes, but correct me. Oh, okay. If a big gym dude smacked Sarah's butt, would you fight him? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Wait, what? Have you made love to a man? No. Jesus. <laughs> Okay. 
I don't know who needs to hear this, but if you're a plus-sized queen who's hiding the fact that she's plus-sized on dating apps by taking photos like this, you're not slick. And to be quite honest with you, I don't care why you're masculine. I don't, it don't care. Even matter. I don't care what happened to you as a, I'm a 40 year old man. I you don't got a care. daughter? No, I don't. Because but that's not fair. Your feminine. But my point is this. My point is this. <laughs> right. You all wouldn't care if a mm -hmm. man came to you feminine and said, my dad wasn't in my life. My mom didn't teach me this. You say, bro, you 38 years old. I don't want to deal with a feminine man that hasn't addressed his mm -hmm. issues. So for me, dealing with a woman that way, I'm going to tell you the same thing. I understand you had issues or whatever growing care. up and you had to be a certain <laughs> way. But I'm not going to put up with it as far as trying to be in a relationship with you. And that's exactly how it should be. Equality is what matters the most in a relationship. Come on, everyone. Come on, everyone. Uh, first of all, I pray that we all have a safe trip. Uh, at this time, I would like to uh, propose to my fiance. My girlfriend since she was 13 years old. We were both 15 years old at the time, and we've been girlfriend and boyfriend since she was 13. And I would like to propose to her at this time. Date a guy that's shorter than you? Absolutely not. I'd at least six two. At least six two. Yeah. How tall are you? Five five. Five five. Yeah. So six five. two. Well, five six five five. Six yeah. two bare minimum. Yeah, I just like tall. You don't fuck. You don't support any of my businesses. Okay. Ain't nothing special about you except that you're carrying my baby. Oh well. Ain't nothing like nothing special about you, bro. Honestly, there's not. There's not. Nothing, bro. Like, I like you just every day you make me miserable. Every day you argue. Every day is something, bro. No, like, I don't. Yes, every day is something new, bro. I could be sitting and you just automatically, bro, just bring some. Doesn't even have to do with any of the. Uh, today, bro, it's called the past is the past. Live in the future, bro. The mm -hmm. past is the past when it was four days ago. Oh, oh, that you went and saw. What? What'd you say? What'd you say? Nothing. Nothing. So you're admitting that you're a cheater, right? Alright, this was it for today's video guys. If you enjoyed today's video then make sure you smash that like button and yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Until then, I'm out. Peace.